Diagnostic Microbiology A Laboratory Manual Purpose To presumptively differentiate between coagulase negative Staphylococci, Staphylococcus epidermidis, and Staphylococcus saprophyticus that are isolated from urine. Principle Novobiosin inhibits replication of DNA, leading to death of bacteria. Novobiosin binds to DNA gyrase and blocks ATPase during the DNA replication. Flow chart. The flow chart shows that gram stain, catalase, and coagulase tests are prerequisites for novobiosin tests. Tested bacteria should be gram positive cocci, catalase positive, and coagulase negative. Methods. Provide each student group with two sheep blood agar plates, one with this epidermidis and the other with this saprophyticus. Methods. From a pure culture, Pick two to three isolated colonies and prepare 0.5 McFarland standard suspension in a still and normal saline or triptychase soy broth, TSB. Methods. Deep swab into suspension and squeeze against two boards. Streak Miller Hinton agar into two directions. Allow to stand for 10 to 15 minutes. Methods. Under aseptic techniques, apply two tests of 5 microgram novobiosin and press gently. Incubate aerobically at 35 to 37 degrees centigrade for 24 hours. Interpretation. Using a ruler or a caliber, measure the zone of inhibition for both tests. A zone of inhibition greater than 16 millimeters is considered sensitive and thus diagnosed as S. epidermidis, while less than 16 millimeters is considered resistant and thus S. saprophyticus. Integrity of desks. The performance of novobiosin depends on the integrity of desk. Proper storage and expiration days should be maintained. Troubleshoots. See table for troubleshoots and possible causes. For accurate diagnosis, other confirmatory tests are recommended. Quality control. QC is performed whenever a new lot of reagent or media are purchased or prepared. Listed below are ATCC bacteria and their expected results. Report. Use this table to report results. References.